You don't launch until it's right. In Florida, Artemis 1 remains on the ground, with NASA postponing its latest historic launch to the moon, a mission 50 years after Apollo. Artemis is, according to Greek mythology, the twin sister of Apollo, and uh, she is the goddess of hunting and also the goddess of the moon. All right, first 25 seconds. It's a sight many wait to see at Baylor University. The physics department knows what this could mean for the future of astronomy. We humankind learned so much by sending rockets, probes, and humans to space that it's really incredible. Making dreams to the moon and beyond. Um, personally, I am really, really interested in the Mars mission. Possible. Well, my personal goal someday is to be an astronaut on one of them. Um, so it's just really, really cool to see that, you know, the first steps, the baby steps that we're taking, um, taking to get there. When the launch eventually happens, NASA will be on track to send their astronauts by 2025, committing to landing the first woman on the moon. There aren't very many women in my class, and so I'm just really, really excited to see, um, and you know, I really, really hope that this will inspire more women, more young girls to pursue science. Until then, space diehards will take this opportunity to learn more about our planet. Finally having the opportunity to make new experiments, uh, test other things that we haven't tested in the past, spend more time uh, outside uh, our planet. For future scientists to like explore. To the first step of Apollo 17. Reporting in Waco, Nikia Simon, 25 News. Okay, Nikia.